Hi, welcome back to Sharon from Vivid Days. I wanted some fun this evening in my creative space. So while I was tidying it up, I found this peacock silicone mould from Amazon. I purchased a little while ago. So I wanted to have a go with that. And I used the Colour Cottage, Bluebird Blue, Heather Glen and Totally Teal. I applied a little bit of glitter. At this stage, I really didn't know what it was going to turn out like. It looked a lot of detail in the mould. I didn't know whether I was going to have gaps or anything like that. But I just wanted to have a little bit of fun. I do apologise that it's not very clear on the white paper. Um, but underneath, I've got a piece of art that's curing. So overall, it worked really well. It was very, very little resin that was needed. It applied really well and it dried really well and you get to see the end result. So just want to take this time to thank everybody for watching this video and for your ongoing support. If you do want to purchase this silicone or you're interested in the colour cottage colours that was used or any of the materials I use, check the description underneath. There is so many opportunities when it comes to the resin moulds, so have some fun. Use any leftovers that you've got and it's a really great way to embellish some other art. So I'd love for you to have a go and let me know how that works for you. So have the most amazing day. I'm going to see how easy this mould comes out and if it's successful. It's the first time I've used it. It's the peacock. So I'm not too sure if I'm going to have herbal walls in there or anything, but I just wanted to have a play last night and try, try this mould out and see. So let's see if it pops out easily and what we look like we have got. Still got to cure 100%, but I can take it out of this now. Wow, that's the wow! <laughs> so much detail on this, and never didn't because um, when you order them and they come, it's just stunning. Look at the detail on that. Not only his face and his feathers, but they come into little. I'll hold it down that way you can see it. There's different layers on them, and because I added that little bit of glitter. It is just beautiful. So it's a thumbs up for this mould and I will put a link on those but I've got lots of ideas of what I can do with this. But he's so pretty. I hope you enjoy him too.